This is Sasha from the AutismHelper.com, and this is the product preview of Visual Resources for Gym Class. So sometimes specials can be a struggle for children with autism or special needs because the same types of, of supports aren't utilized within that special class. So this resource is designed to decrease problem behavior and increase communication through the same types of interventions we use on a daily basis in our class. So this resource is full of schedules, visuals, and behavior management tools that can be quickly utilized by a gym teacher in the gym class. So first up is a schedule. This is really important. This is something I've worked with with my gym teacher at my school. We want to show our kids exactly what they're supposed to be doing when they enter the gym. So there's a quick board of a few different options, and then there's a ton of different sport and ex exercise options. So students can know exactly what activities they're doing every morning. And if there's something specific that your gym class does that isn't included in here, I'd be happy to make something specific to add in. Um, next up is also a first then. Sometimes our kids need to be have a different little bit of motivation to engage in some of these gym activities. So maybe you want to say, yep, first we're doing bowling, but then you can have break time. So all these pictures fit right onto here to show first then. Next are some gym communication visuals. We really want to make sure our students have ways to communicate that aren't just problem behaviors. So we want to give them visuals that are easy to use. So instead of having to engage in a problem behavior, behavior to express themselves, they can use visuals. So how does this activity make you feel? So students might be able to express their emotions more readily utilizing this communication board. Next are some common gym class visuals. So commonly in gym, students might want water, want a break, want to remove themselves from activity. These would be great to laminate and post on the wall that students can easily grab. So instead of running out of the room, they can pass you the I want water picture. Next are two social stories for common gym situations. Social stories are great because they tell students what they should be doing, not what they shouldn't be doing. So, and it triggers it to common situations. So doing something I don't like. A lot of my students struggle with this. Sometimes we're playing a sport that isn't preferred, but we have to do it anyways. Also being a good loser. That's a common issue also. So how to deal with losing and what types of things they should do are specifically scripted in this story. Last is a specific gym good and beha bad behavior visual. So we really wanna clearly show our students what they should be doing and what they shouldn't be doing in a nice structured visual way. So again, this was a product preview of visual resources for gym class by theautismhelper.com.